Hi guys, this is Watsy playing Boom Beach and today we're here with the new update and just to show you, I've already got my HQ21 because I've been on holiday so I haven't been able to do any videos but I have been playing it while I've been away. So I've got my HQ21 which is absolutely brilliant, I've managed to get that. Um, I've put on a Shield Generator 3 as well. So I'm just going to show you my health of my HQ. I've got 345,000 Shield, 160 health and also plus 70,000 as well. So I've actually got quite a lot of shield there and what I've done is put the shield pretty much behind the HQ so that, well I've seen a lot of bases where they put the shield generator sort of around the middle but I mean if you're plowing through the base anyway you're going to take that out before you get to the HQ so this stops a lot more of the attacks because obviously it takes them longer to take out the HQ. Um, I am boosted up at the moment and the reason is because I want to move my armory to HQ 21 uh, to level 21 sorry I have actually upgraded my um, what do you call it my art artillery to max level so that's now 5600 uh, so that's really good so that's max level um, and I'm now finding it that because I'm not max level uh, the ops are actually a lot harder so we're back down to doing powder keg at the moment and um, we managed to complete to complete that no problems but mambo we found a bit hard so um, what we're doing is just going back to powder keg for a little bit just to keep the points in balance and then we'll go to Mambo again and uh, try and complete that once we're a bit more fluent with the uh, prototype defences in the operations as well. Um, I haven't maxed out any more defences really um, but the level 21 machine guns look absolutely awesome I can't wait to get those. So anyway at the moment I'm trying to max out my storages to get to the Armoury 21 so I'm going to take on a few player bases. I've kept ones on my map that have got reasonable resource. Ones that um, are going to do me quite well. But one problem I have done is I've actually got rid of my uh, resource reward statue. So I've had to get another one. And the only one I've actually got now is like a 20 odd percent one. 25 percent. Might even be 24 percent. Which is absolute rubbish. But it's all I can do at the moment really. So it'll have to do so I've boosted that up anyway so I'm getting about 50% extra resource which really isn't very good but it, like I say it's better than nothing I've yeah I, I deleted one I deleted them totally because I was pretty pretty much on the way to being maxed so I had no real need for it but now obviously they've brought the update out and you can upgrade pretty much everything uh, I need to I need more resource again um, so I've had to get one back so like I say it's not a very good one but if I boost it it's nearly 50% or it is 50% so I mean that'll do me uh, it's good well it's better than nothing anyway uh, so I want to find another base this one's pretty good here 61 a lot of resource and they've got a doom cannon 3 which is never good uh, how many statues have they got no ice statues so I suppose that's kind of good for me so I'm going to drop them all up the left hand side. I'm going to try and take out this Doom Cannon first. So I'm going to double chuck a barrage on that. And chuck one artillery for the moment. And it needs another one so I'll throw that down. And I'm just going to throw some critters over here. Try and clear out them boom mines. And that shock mine which is well which is good. So let's throw a shot down on that shock launcher. Shock blaster even. Uh, don't really care about that boom cannon at the front will the, uh, the normal cannon as a matter of fact so let's shock up those boom cannons and shock that shock blaster as well so I don't really want to lose any troops I don't mind if I do too much but I'd, I would rather not uh, I've got a shock mine there don't really care about that I mean the shock mines are a very good idea especially with warrior attacks and stuff but to be honest most of the time it's just like being hit with a shock launcher so I don't find them that that bad really and if you blow them up anyway they still do the shock ring so you might as well just let your troops hit them and um, not actually worry about it. I've got a scorcher down here who's struggling a little bit so I've just chucked what six heals on him. It's not really going to make much difference but it might give him an extra cannon shot so uh, I did that anyway but we took him down with no losses as well so I'm just going to see how much more I need to increase this armory and I've actually got quite a lot of gold now and I've got gold coming from my victory point reward which is 1.6 mil and also 2.3 mil from my task force operation so 
what I'm planning to do is upgrade that. Hopefully not have to spend any diamonds, but I'm going to diamond finish it because I want to do another upgrade. And ideally, I really want to upgrade my tanks or my scorchers. Probably my tanks, because I think it's going to be more beneficial than the scorchers because I pretty much boost up my scorchers all the time. So obviously, unless I'm just attacking a normal base for no reason um, other than just to keep my victory points up. So who else are we going to go and attack? got 59 55 i'm going to go to the ones with the higher resource so i'm just going to have a quick look about 62 62 looks all right so we've got ice statues but nothing too major okay so what i'm actually going to do here i'm not actually going to destroy that doom cannon because i don't think i'll be able to i'm going to throw down a shock on it and i see some boom mines behind those statues so i'll get rid of those I just want to keep this Doom Cannon shot. So I'll keep that one shot. And I'm going to throw down a couple of barrages. Well, no, not a couple of barrages. On the um, Boom Cannon over there. Take that out with another artillery. So just chuck three artilleries on that Boom Cannon. And we've got a couple of Boom Mines over here. Which I do not want to go towards my tank. So I'm going to send everyone over the right hand side. Keep them out of the way of those cannons. Uh, Scorcher goes over a shock mine, doesn't really matter, like I say. They just pause them. It's like being hit with a shock launcher, and I've already got two fire at me anyway. So I see someone here has already got a sniper tower up to 21, which looks really cool. Uh, I am really liking the new up, the new uh, graphic updates. Like I love the bits on here where you're actually leaving bits of the defense rather than just rubble on the floor. You know, you might actually see like a turret from a machine gun and stuff like that, which is really, really good. I do like that. So um, I think there's been a lot of good updates in this in, in this one. So uh, yeah, definitely, definitely loving this one. Definitely loving it. <coughs> um, also, I'm looking forward to the seven stages of Hammond to see what that brings. That um, sounds quite cool. I mean, I'm I'm pretty much able to do every one every time anyway. So it'll be interesting to see what they can actually bring. So we've got a level 58 here. Nothing really major to worry about. Shot blaster at the front. Cannon at the front. So I'm going to drop them all up the left hand side. And I don't think I'm going to bother shocking. I might shock that shock launcher. Yeah, let's throw a shot down on the shock launcher. I'm going to throw some critters on on that boom mine there and then now I can leave that be I need to take out this shock blast of three that's a good idea and we've got some boom mines over here which are not going down very well um, I'm actually going to bring them all back fall back fall back what are you doing, Scorcher? Get out of the way. Just gonna throw down a load of smokes. Just try and keep them out of the way. Just gonna throw a shot down on that boom cannon over there and the shock launcher. Need to try and take down that shock blaster as well. Throw a smoke down over there. And keep them over the right hand side. Just gonna throw a shot on that shock blaster again. Need to try and take that out with some artillery. I really shouldn't have bothered avoiding that boom cannon. I should have just left them to it, but oh well. You live and learn, don't you? So I am going to lose a scorcher here, but I don't think that matters too much. Let's try and take that. No, we need another one on the shot blaster. That's really annoying. Right, so we can chuck another artillery on that now. And we still got a boom cannon at the back firing at us, but I don't think it matters. We're going to be taking this HQ down. There we go. So we only lost one scorcher and one tank so that's not too bad really for the amount of resource we're going to get from this um, I'm quite happy with it so there we go how much resource do we need now we can upgrade it right sweet so let's put the upgrade in 475 wow okay that's a lot more than I anticipated but I'm going to do it anyway right so we've finished off we're at armory level 21 and now look at all the upgrades oh my god i love it absolutely love it and i really want to upgrade my barrage but i'm not going to i'm going to upgrade my tanks maybe 
uh, that puts us to 500 damage per second, which is quite a lot. Um, Scorcher goes up 3,000 health and also goes up 90 damage per second. All the warriors, all the warriors. Oh no, there's just so much to upgrade. Absolutely so much to upgrade, right. So I'm gonna collect all the gold from this and see how much we have. What does that equate to? Right, that equates to a lot of gold, to eight and a half million gold. Um, we are going to upgrade the, oh wow, the grenadiers can be upgraded as well. I can't believe everything can be upgraded. They've, they've just given you so much more option now and given me so much more work to do. Um, right, we're going to upgrade the tanks, I think. Are we going to upgrade the tanks? Oh my god, I've got the shock mines to upgrade. I don't know what the max level of those is. I don't really want to know. Okay, so we're... Oh, do you know what, guys? I'm so confused now. I don't know whether to upgrade the scorchers or the tanks because the scorchers are more which means I've got to do this all again. No, I'm upgrading the tanks. Right, I've upgraded my tanks. So my tanks are going to level 11 now. No, they're not. They're going to level 15 now. 16 now. I'll get there in the end. So, uh, yeah, I really really look forward to testing those out. Now, I'm not going to diamond finish those, so that is going to be four days, 16 hours. Actually, that's probably a lie. I probably will diamond finish them at some point, but not any time soon. Anyway, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll try and bring you another one again fairly soon. Alright, cheers guys.